everyone, it's Kiara and welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. So we are starting this episode off. It seems as if Uku has thrown Alexandra a baby shower. It's currently seven in the morning. Alexandra was waking up feeling passionate. So I thought, okay, I mean, we already had the bachelorette party in the last episode. Might as well do the baby shower, you know? So we do have work, but we're still going to do this. Oh, because Arturo has to go to work too, but I want him to go. He's going to have to go, but he could, you know, stay for a little while. I want to invite Akira. Is that wrong? If you saw my last video, you know exactly why I want to invite him. But anyway, we'll, we'll leave him out. We'll leave him out. Whoa, she is pregnant. Wow. Wait a minute. Are we in... You took us to someone else's house? Because I know you don't live here. That's crazy. And someone's in the shower currently. I hope that's the person who lives here. Yeah, he has work in an hour. I'm going to make him jog while he's here. <laughs> Look at her just eating a bowl of cereal. Just eating a bowl of cereal. Oh, she is so... She is glowing. She is so... Look at her. I just realized we're at someone else's house. One second. Stop. No, 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 no. Elise, Elise, do not come in here. Elise, no. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop. Do not come in here. Do not... Stop. Can I help you? Go to work. Go to work. It's okay. Oh my god, look at her stomach. Is it supposed to be doing that? Oh my gosh. Elise, I need you to leave, hun. Can you please go somewhere else in the house? Uh, we're gonna have Arturo. Have him socialize with co-workers. He doesn't really know too many people. Get out of the bathroom. Oh my gosh. Ruined it. Thank you. Okay, continue what I was doing. But you can't see me though. No, but you can't see me. <laughs> Oh, but I did it, though. Go to work. Join. Let's go. That was a nice way to start the episode. Getting caught while clogging someone's drain. Which I'm trying to understand why Uku invited us. I don't even think... Was he there? Did you guys see him? I don't think I saw him. I was too busy looking at other things to really be paying attention like I was supposed to. But, yeah. I don't even think he was there. Look at him. Sitting at his desk. See? I don't even think he was there. If you guys saw him, let me know, but I swear to you I did not see him. Okay, we still need to get everything so we can make this Electroflux wormhole generator. Ooh, is this uncommon? Yes! Okay, we at least have two. Oh, we're definitely staying late today. <laughs> There's no question. <gasps> is she okay? Oh my god, toxic fumes. <laughs> oh, that is not what we need right now. <gasps> Are you kidding me? She's at work. We haven't done anything. Okay. 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 We have to go. We have to go. We have to go. We're gonna have to leave work early. We only get 120 simoleons because we left early. <laughs> oh my gosh. No. Why did she have to have it right now? Okay. Let's go. I don't know if Arturo can make it, but we'll see. You bought a pastry. Okay. Not like your wife's in labor or anything. You're gonna come into this room, sir. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, <gasps> she had a baby girl. Yay. Okay, so I've been racking my brain since the last video trying to figure out what baby names to do that were kind of associated with Rose and Red. And the one that came to my mind was Ruby. I really like that name. Um, if you guys have any other suggestions, like I said, let me know in the comments down below. But I kind of like Ruby, so we're going to name her Ruby. Please let it just be one. I'm scared to click this check mark, you guys. <laughs> I'm closing my eyes. I can't. Oh, okay, good. There was one baby in there. You would think there was twins the way her stomach was looking earlier. All right. If you can make it and beat the clock, you're not going to make it. <laughs> The baby's like, who on earth are you? 
there you guys have it all you guys who said that she was having a girl in the comments down below i do want to have her have more than just one kid i just don't know how many children i want her to have didn't really think in my mind okay so let's see where they place the child because all the time they place babies in the weirdest places for some odd reason okay oh in the room with them should i make them have that sacrifice i think so let's make this as realistic as possible you know get some leftovers there's a lot of mac and cheese she was on a mac and cheese kick when she was pregnant with ruby can we just put that out there why is he still running <laughs> He's still running in the panic walk. Oh, by the way, I don't know why I didn't point this out sooner. Um, as you can see, I did flip both the dining room and the living room because I was getting sick and tired of them getting up with their dirty, dirty dishes from the dining area here and walking into here and washing them. So I did switch them around because it was driving me insane. And now that I'm noticing, there needs to be a lot more light in here. Okay, why do I why am I getting so much lag relax and can she have a moment? She literally went from being pregnant for 24 hours to Automatically being on her period after labor like I'm not understanding Julia. Oh, Julia. Why do you look so sad? Of course you can come over to hang out Let's ask about her day. Let's ask her what's going on Her phone is blowing up Clayton Carmona is wondering if I want to go over his house and hang out. I cannot. We just had a baby. Oh, you're going through it. I understand. I really do. Wait a minute. Okay. Whew, I was starting to freak out. Okay, his birthday's tomorrow. We got to throw him a little surprise party. Whew, I was almost about to freak out. I thought we forgot our Charles' birthday. I know I've been neglecting him. You don't have to tell me. I know. And I feel bad already about it. But I was really freaking out because I thought we did forget his birthday. But we didn't. And before I actually end this episode, Arturo, we're going to have to leave you at home with the baby. Because we got some mischief to do. Because I need to get this clogged drain part of her aspiration out of the way. Because it's driving me crazy. Let's go to Sam Ice, you know. Oh, crap. Which one is Raj's apartment? Is it this one? No one is available to chat. It's not that one. Okay, here we go. I've never actually been inside Raj's apartment, so I'm really curious to see what his apartment looks like inside. Hi, my name is Alexandra. Thank you for inviting me in. You have no idea what you've just done. I'm looking around. It's really nice in here. Okay. It's really not bad in here. Oh, look, he has a little exercise equipment. Maybe we could have bought Arturo. Missed opportunity. It's all right. Huh? What? You can't see me though. No. They're getting smarter. Ever since I tried to trash the pancakes house, they've gotten smarter. It doesn't matter. I did it anyway. We're going somewhere else. Bye. <laughs> All right. Where should we go to next? Brittany and Dirk Dreamer. Oh, we're going here. I need to see this. Because like Brittany, we have Eliza Pancakes, who's our enemy. And Brittany's our enemy, but not our enemy. Because she is always doing stuff to anger us. But she's not really an enemy. She's just annoying. But how? I just want to know how. Is it this one? That's Akira, so we're going here. I just remembered. We haven't been doing what we should be doing, and that's freezing these folks. What's their baby's name? Oh, uh, do we not get to know what the baby's name is? Well, that sucks. I would love to know. Sorry, Dirk. Nothing against you. You're just in the way. And Brittany, you're next. And I have no problem freezing you because you are such an annoyance. Yep. All right, and I'm going to clog your drain. I'll just be a moment. I like how this is now going up, but it didn't go up when we were in the pancakes house. Clearly, we're not meant to be pranking Eliza pancakes in her own house. That's what we learned. Did it work? Boom. Okay, our work here is done. Let's leave. <laughs> this is a nice little episode, you know. I mean, Alexandra was only pregnant for like 24 hours, and then before I knew it, she was in labor. But... You know, at least we got some stuff done. Wait a minute. Hold, hold on. We're missing someone. Where's Arturo? 
Oh, he's outside playing. He loves this chess table more than Alexandra does, which is weird because she's the one who needs the logic skill. Anyway, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please be sure to give it a like, leave a kind comment, plus subscribe. And I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye, everyone.